Alright, hello everyone, how are you guys doing? Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Today we are here with another video and it has to do with the update today of Kuwambon Fishing. Now basically what I'll be comparing today is whether or not Kuwambon Fishing is better than Monkfish Fishing for Iron Men. So what we're going to go ahead and do is get us some bait and get on into it. So we will be testing this on a main account. We have 80 fishing so these may not be the best rates in the game that you can expect to get, but it is a decent level and we should be able to do some good work. So now we're going to go ahead and try to find some of this bait, which is going to be really hard considering I, I'm, I'm assuming every world's pretty much just out of stock. One interesting thing that I don't think a lot of people saw coming is that Raw Karabon are actually holding a really good price. Uh, surprisingly, they haven't dropped a ton since their price whenever it came out, so I'm pretty impressed by that, that Jax was try that was able to balance it this well, at least right off the bat. It may end up changing over time, but for right now, I mean, it's not too bad. And you can make a decent amount of money actually cooking these, about 200 per one. All right, and there we go. Only have 12 left, so I'm just going to go ahead and end it there. Basically, what I was averaging was 30k XP an hour, so that's not bad at all. So 30k XP an hour means that you should be able to catch around 600 uh, raw Kawamban per hour. And, I mean, with the 600, basically, we can see what my catch-fail rate was. I had a 1,000 of these to start, and then if we go ahead and look, how many do we have now? So we have 500. So, I mean, go ahead and we even this out, 6 one way, 6 the other. Pretty much 510 is how many, so about 50%, maybe 50 to 51%, depending on what you're fishing level is so basically at every hour what's going to happen you'll need to spend five minutes actually buying the bait and you'll need to get about 12,500 of them and then you can spend those fishing now since you can get 30 kxp an hour and you aren't fishing for five minutes of the hour you only get 11 twelfths of what that xp is so you actually only end up getting 27.5k xp per hour in around 600 kawamban so for those of you that may be wondering if you're not an iron man you actually plan on selling these 302k is what i was able to get however you'll be fishing about 600 per hour so you could expect probably around 360k per hour on average all right now time for the fun part monkfish fishing oh my god look at all these people got the wrong size net Alright, so after a little bit of testing with 80 fishing, keep that in mind, XP rates will vary depending on your level, I was able to get 36k per hour monk fishing, while I was able to get 27.5k per hour using Karambons. Now take into account, that does assume the time that it takes to actually buy the bait. Now with monkfish, I was able to get 300 individual fish per hour, while with Karambons, I was able to get 550 per hour. Now with that said, if you look in terms of cooking XP for these things, basically with 99 cooking, assuming you burn none of these, you get 45k cooking XP per hour with the monkfish that you get and you get 104k cooking xp per hour with the kuwambons that you get however here the kuwambons are a little different because if you use the hasidious house and you have cooking gauntlets you can stop burning at 93 but 99 with a cooking capes guaranteed now in terms of hp that you can actually heal yourself with from both of these considering that monkfish are lower than kuwambons basically every hour you're getting 4.8 thousand HP healed from monk fishing and 9.9 thousand per hour with Karambons. Now that's a comparison in and of itself, but if you want to compare this to somewhere around 82 cooking, which is the level that you stop burning monk fish with cooking gauntlets on, um, basically with cooking gauntlets, you'll get the same XP rates as you were before with monk fish at 99, but with Karambons, you will drop about 13,000 XP per hour and you'll drop about 12,000 HP healed per hour or 1200 excuse me. Now from here it's really up to you to decide which way you want to go about doing this. Um, it is really good to buy Karambons from the shop but that does require a lot of stuff so if you are looking to fish food basically with monkfish there is an added plus that you do get more XP per hour. You get 36k opposed to the 27.5k with Karambons and on top of that the cooking XP I don't really know if it matters that much to Iron Man because if you cook monkfish you are still going to end up with a ton of cooking XP. You'll have enough to get 99 cooking if you get 99 fishing obviously and if you get 99 fishing doing Karambons basically you're just going to have a ton of food and you'll have like 30 to 40 mil cooking XP which is just a waste of time but you will have a ton of food so really there's no way for me to tell you guys which is better this is more of a decision that you have to make on your own based on the results that you see so hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you guys did make sure to leave a like if there's anything you want to tell me comment that down below any other comparisons you guys want to see in the future let me know subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content I have my twitch and twitter in the description below along with joining my clan chat large XP lamp if you want to help me out feel free to join say what's up hit me up in game but with that said hopefully you guys have a wonderful day and peace